Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. This is the first news on 27th February newspaper front page dot. Pakistan Qatar signed 10 year LNG supply contract. Contract. Uh, Prime Minister aside, Prime Minister Saidi says the political military approach behind the lowest ever publicity publicly and disclose the price in the world by Kalikiani. Islamba, Pakistan and Qatar have signed another long-term liquefied natural gas and energy supply contract for additional 200 million cubic feet a day MMCFD at around 31% lower rate than the 2015 contract for 500 MMCFD. The 10 year agreement signed on Friday and titled the lowest ever publicly disclosed price on a long term contract in the world and was achieved through joint efforts of the political and military leaderships, said the special assistant to the Prime Minister on Petroleum Latin Ababa while speaking at a news conference after the signing ceremony. The Pakistan Tariq in sub government had at the outset of its term tried to negotiate the long-term contracts with Qatar signed by the Pakistan Muslim League Nawaz government in 2015-2016 with a similar assertion that it had uh, secured the lowest long-term price and no major LNG purchases much larger than Pakistan had until then bought such a price. Qatar had plainly declined even to discuss the existing contract, saying it had dozens of similar long-term contracts with other countries and did not want to set a precedent, but had offered to provide 20 to 25 percent surprise discounts for the additional 200 mm CFD LNG supplies, considering the close friendly relations between the two countries. However, the offer did not materialize then, as Pakistan did not have a capacity of beyond 100 mm CFD additional quantities at the time, and also due to this disagreement within the cabinet for political reasons. Mr. Baba told the press that the supply and the new Qatar deal would replace demand of the two existing and expiring long term deals. Under the new agreement, which will be effective from January 2022, Qatar will initially deliver two ships containing a total of around 200 mm CFD of LNG a month. Later, the supplies will be enhanced up until four ships, 400 mm CFD at the rate of 10.2% of rent. In contrast, the first Park Qatar LNG contract has been signed for 15 years, beginning with 100 mm CFD, one ship each month, and later going up until 500 mm CFD, five ships a month at the rate of 13.37% of rent. The new contract has a price negotiation and renegotiation option after four years rather than 10 years uh, that had been fixed in the previously signed contract. The Prime Minister's AD said that the total support uh, purchases as of December 2020 averaged at 11.90% of rent compared to 13.37% of rent in initial three long-term contracts. Signed about five years ago, the new Qatar price at 10.2% of rent is also 15 to 16% lower than average for purchases of 11.90% of rent and would ensure price stability and affordability along with supply security.
Based on the volume of the new contract, Pakistan would pay about a total of 316 million lower cost when compared to the same volume under the existing contract, Mr. Barber said. In 10 years, this works out to be $1.3 billion, he added. Pakistan is providing $170 million letter of credit. LC is under the past contract compared to $84 million under the new contract, which is also almost half, he said. Total supplies under the fresh contract would start at 3 million tons compared to about 3.75 million tons of contracted quantities. He said the price supplies would replace the long term contract of commodity trade Gunover, uh, Gunover, uh, that expired in December lost, and another it would end in another 18 months. This way, he explained the two new but deeper uh, shipments about the replace the two expensive shipments of the past. Mr. Barber said uh, the new contract will become operational in January 2022, but also provided for at least one additional ship in December this year, if needed. He said Pakistan State Oil after the import the LNG from further under the New Deal as well. But flexibility terms had been incorporated in the contract in case import order was to be assigned to Pakistan LNG Limited, he added. The Prime Minister's AD recalled that talks with Qatar had been initiated about two years ago when Prime Minister Imran Khan had visited Doha for the first time and then had to see more engagements with the army of Qatar. Responding to a question, he said Pakistan's military leadership also had dynamic relations with Qatar uh, that had been facilitating the talks between the United States and the Taliban for peace in Afghanistan. He said both the military leadership and the political leadership had the common interest to work in the larger interest of all, and the deal was one such joint effort. Earlier, Mr. Khan witnessed the signing of the agreement by Minister for Energy Kamala Yukon and his visiting counterpart from Qatar, Saad Shirida Shiridal Kabi. And in the end, the former request, if you have not yet, to please subscribe our channel and press like and bell button to get the fresh from us. Thank you for watching. Have a nice time. Goodbye.